We're at Fukuma 2021, all about injection molding on the Fanuc stand, but straight away you'll notice this is not an injection molding machine, it is an EDM machine, the RoboCut. Stefan, tell me a bit about yourself and the machine, please. Uh, I'm salesman of RoboCut Europe. I'm supporting our subsidiaries in Europe for the RoboCut. It's about injection molding, injection molding machines, your RoboShop machines. So why are you showcasing the RoboCuts? Uh, here on the exhibition on the Fakuma, we have many mold customers and we want to go more into this mold market, uh, more and more for the future. Now with this machine, what is so good about it? Uh, the reliability okay. of our machine because we use less parts okay. and less parts means easy to repair and easy to operate. Perfect, so very few components in here to go wrong and all made by Fanuc. The machine is 100% made by Fanuc, yeah. Yeah. the servo drives, the boil screws, the controller, everything is made by Fanuc. Okay, you say servo drives and ball screws, why, why do you use those options? The servo motor and the boil screw is very rigid, also the machine body is very okay. rigid which makes it possible to make very accurate cutting. Okay, now when you say accurate cutting, what sort of components are you manufacturing and what materials? Uh, very hard materials, tough materials, we can cut by the electrical spout. Okay. Uh, we can also cut materials like a diamond, hard like wow. diamonds. So PCD, tungsten? PCD, tungsten carbide. Okay, and so with these machines, what sort of accuracy? For example, for taper cutting, it's very accurate. We can achieve 10 microns or wow. less. Now, you've got different size wire, different diameter wire, is that correct? Now, the standard wire size is 0 0.1 to 0 0.3. Yep. And we have an option for thin wires. This is down to 0 0.05 wow. diameter, diameter. And we have an option for this, no? for the okay. 400, for the small machine. No? We have an option for thin wire. You say 400, what other size machines do you have? We have a 400, a 600 and an 800. The 400 means 400 millimeter x-axis stroke, yep. 600 means also x-axis stroke okay. eight, and so on. The 800 has yep. 800 millimeter x-axis okay. stroke. Now this process is not about being really, really fast, but what happens if the wire breaks, for example? Uh, the, if the wire breaks, so the machine automatically repair the wire, right. make the refreading, so you can operate a machine unmanned over the weekend. Now also in terms of controls, because the HMI is, has been upgraded, is that correct? Yes, we have the new, the latest FANU controller on the machine, yeah, which makes it easy to repair and simple to operate. The simple adjustment function and this, the graphic is much more faster compared to the previous model. Now you've already said about this is aimed at mold manufacturers. Why would I buy one? For mold manufacturers, it's the advantage is the taper cutting. Yeah? Yes. We have an improved taper cutting accuracy and a new taper chick. Um, this is very interesting for the mold makers. Right. So I've got a robo shop. I want to bring this in house. Is that yeah. correct? Uh, in house, the advantage is you can take the mold and you can put it on the wire EDM and repair yeah. and so on. Repair, adjust, all very, very simple. Yeah. And then I can run it over the weekend. So it's broken on a Friday, it's all fixed on the Monday. Yes. Excellent, Stefan. That's a great little overview of the RoboCut from Fanuc, and we're at Fukuma 2021.